Reading 012, Unit 6, Lesson 2, Echinacea. It works. Oops, it works not. By the end of Unit 6, Lesson 2, you'll be able to recognize the main idea in the reading text, or locate important information in the text. Vocabulary. The NIH, the National Institute of Health, is part of the U.S. Department of Health and Human Services. It is the main federal agency for supporting and conducting medical research. Not clinically effective, in other words, shown not to be effective when studied in a clinic or hospital. Cold symptoms are the signs that tell you that you have a cold. Placebo is a substance given to a patient instead of medicine, without patients knowing it is not real. Preview the newspaper article below. Underline the title, the first sentence of each paragraph, and the last sentence of the text as you preview. Then answer the following questions. What is the topic of the article? What is the main idea of the article? What is the bad news that NIH has? Who is Ronald Turner? Echinacea. It works. Oops, it works not. By Elizabeth Wise. The National Institute of Health, NIH, has bad news for millions of Americans. They spend $155 million a year on the popular herbal remedy, echinacea, to treat the cough and runny nose of their common colds. But echinacea, a new study shows, doesn't work. It's not clinically effective, says Ronald Turner. Turner should know. He is an expert on the common cold at the University of Virginia School of Medicine. He wrote the major echinacea study. His study, reported in the current New England Journal of Medicine, is the best test ever done on the effectiveness of the herbal remedy, says Stefan Strauss. Strauss directs the NIH's National Center for Complementary and Alternative Medicine. Turner is in the third year of his study of three years that shows that echinacea was not effective in lessening cold symptoms in children or young adults. The findings of these three studies are the opposite of positive reports on echinacea's effects, mostly from studies done in Europe. In Turner's study, researchers at the University of Virginia randomly gave 399 volunteers either echinacea or a placebo for seven days. They then put drops containing cold germs in their noses to give them colds. Finally, the researchers left them alone in the hotel room so that they couldn't get a cold from anyone or anything else. The goal was to find out if taking echinacea prevents infection or can limit the length of the cold. The answer was no, Turner says. It has no effect on the rate at which volunteers got infected or on their symptoms. More than 80% of the volunteers in each group got a cold. The problem with cold with <clears throat> the problem with colds which last about 7 days is no matter what you do you're going to get better, Strauss says. That might make people think that taking echinacea helps when it actually doesn't. Answer the following questions. Number one, what is the topic of the article? Number two, what is the main idea of the article? Number three, what is the bad news the NIH has? Number four, who is Ronald Turner? 